Hi everyone, Anthony here with Slip2000. Today, I'm going to give you a quick overview on how to properly lubricate an AR platform firearm. Let's begin by field stripping this rifle. With our firearm field stripped, let's begin by disassembling our bullet carrier group. First, remove your firing pin retaining pin. Then, tilt your bullet carrier group and the firing pin should fall right out. Next, you're going to remove your cam pin. This retains your bolt. This is as far as we need to go for this video. If underneath your extractor claw gets dirty, you can also remove your extractor and clean under there. But for lubrication purposes, this is as far as we need to go. With our bolt carrier group disassembled, now you can select your favorite Slip 2000 lubricant. For me, it's Slip 2000's EWL30. The slightly thicker viscosity helps the lubricant to stay in place even under high heat and high pressure. We're going to start by lubricating the bolt itself. I place a few drops on the body of the bolt as well as on the gas rings. This is crucial to the function of your firearm. I roll it around and make sure the gas keys have an even coat of lubricant. Once I'm happy with how much lubricant's on the bolt, I reassemble it into the carrier. Followed by the cam pin. and your firing pin. The last step is to reinsert your firing pin retaining pin. Now that your bolts reassembled, there's a few more things that I like to do. I like to add a few drops of lubricant to the channel in which the cam pin rides. And give that a few cycles. Lastly, we need to lubricate the exterior of your carrier. This rides within the upper receiver and makes contact in four main locations. Your upper two rails and your lower two rails. You simply begin by coating each rail with lubricant and wipe in any excess. The last step I like to do to my bolt carrier group is to place a few drops of lubricant on the exterior of the carrier. This isn't so much for function or reliability, however it does pro produce a nice film which is going to repel carbon and make your next cleaning a breeze. The last step we need to take before reassembling our firearm is to lubricate our charging handle. Simply remove the charging handle and place a few drops of lubricant on the body itself. Give that a quick wipe in and we can reassemble our firearm. And that's it. She's ready to go.